Hello, it's Dr. Elizabeth Alter. Are you having trouble with your hair? Hair loss is a common problem that patients present with, and especially in women, but it can happen in men as well. Dyeing your hair could be a pro an issue causing your hair loss. So when patients present with this complaint, the first thing that I try to discuss with them is the mechanical issues that may be contributing to their hair loss. And by mechanical, I mean external things. So whether it's a chemical that you're applying to your hair, um, the biggest culprit in that category is uh, hair dye. But it can also be other mechanical things. For instance, uh, when patients pull back their hair. Um, so I tell patients to try to leave their hair loose, um, uh, such as mine is, or if they are going to pull it back to not do it too tightly as that can stress the follicle and then make the hair uh, fall out more. Other things that are mechanical that can cause hair loss are uh, things such as wearing hats. So avoiding these things are, are part of, of, of avoiding hair loss. But obviously when, when a patient presents with hair loss, we need to look at their labs and hormones. So one of the first um, nutrients that I make sure uh, that the patient is taking and that I check their levels um, is B12. So I usually put patients on a B complex, uh, such as our Super BNX. So a B, complex is, a B complex is important for all patients, but especially for patients that are having hair loss because this is a, an issue with regenerating tissue. And so the B vitamins uh, really help in regeneration of tissue. And specifically, B12 is the workhorse of the cell. So it's important to have that on board. And then the other things I consider are thyroid support, such as our T3 and X. Uh, the thyroid is affected by many things, and many patients um, often complain of thyroid issues affecting their hair, uh, which is a common connection. Now, uh, sometimes even if the patient's labs are normal in terms of their thyroid, if they're having hair loss issues, I will usually... Uh, recommend a thyroid support like our T3NX. And then lastly, uh, the other nutrient I recommend is collagen. So collagen with biotin is very important to strengthen hair. So if, um, if the patient um, has issues with hair loss, I usually recommend collagen with biotin, which is found in our Reginex. And of course, looking, as I said before, at the labs uh, and also the hormones because um, sometimes issues uh, with the, the mood and certain uh, sex hormones such as estrogen and progesterone have to do with hair texture and volume. Well, I hope this helps and have a healthy day.